Hey guys, it's Amanda Panda, and I'm hanging out with my favorite MLP character, Spike. And today, I am going to be transforming Spike into a fish. I was inspired to make this custom because in the new My Little Pony movie that comes out in October, the main six are supposed to be going under the sea, and Spike turns into a fish, so I thought how awesome to make him into an LPS today. I'm using flip splashly to make this custom LPS starting off with some bright green I'm painting the top fin and the back fin this green color is called true green now I'm taking a little bit of acetone and I am going to remove all of Flippa's eyes so that way I can give him some spike eyes later on now I'm taking a shade of purple this is called princess purple and I'm I'm gonna completely cover the little fish's body and this is gonna take probably three coats of paint so I can cover up all of that blue. I love Spike so much. I've already customized him and turned him into Spike the puppy. I've also turned him into a Pokemon, Spike the Charmander, and now Spike the fish. What should I transform Spike into next? Let me know what you think down in the comments below. And now I'm switching over to a really light shade of green. This is called Sour Apple. And I am painting the fins of Spike the Fish. And I'm also going to paint the belly of Spike the Fish so it looks a lot like the real Spike. And this took a total of three coats of paint to get this really nice color and the tail still moves so that is really really cool now i'm gonna start working on spikes eyes i'm gonna start off with some white acrylic paint and just completely fill in the entire eye area I'm gonna use two thick coats of paint for the eyes here. And while that paint's drying, I'm taking a slightly brighter shade of green and I'm going over the fins one more time. And I didn't use this green to begin with because it's a very, very thin paint and it would have taken way too many coats to get this really pretty shade of green. So I put the light green first and now I'm putting a brighter green on top and it really matches Spike because he does have those three shades of green on his body. Now back to the eyes. I'm using that same bright green that I just put on the fins and I am drawing the entire circle area for his eye. And I'm going to give these eyes a really nice ombre effect with different shades of green. So I'm using the bright green I used for his top fin. And I'm just putting in some small details here of the bright green. Now I'm going to take the lighter green from his belly, put some down at the bottom, and a little bit of yellow in the corner. Now I'm switching over to black and I'm painting in the pupils of Spike's eye. And then I'm going to use my nail dotting tool to put one little light reflection right in the corner. All the painting's done. Now I'm going to go over the entire fish with a layer of varnish to seal all of my work in. And what I really love about this particular LPS from the mini style line is that the LPS comes with its own little house. So I'm going to put this all together. It looks just like a little coral reef. I think it's so cute. And is gonna be the perfect little habitat for Spike the fish to live in. So all put together, it has this really nice picture of coral that I'm just gonna slip into the back 
and the little house is all put together super cute i love it and now spike can hang out in his new little house really really cool there's even a little um stand thing in the front and you can have spike hanging out in front of his house i think that spike came out so cute as a fish let me know what you think down below thank you so much for watching little pandas until next time bye You can follow me online to get the latest news and updates like my Facebook page, facebook.com backslash Collector, or follow me on Instagram at Collector. Want to mail me something? Guess what? You can mail it to Mandapanda P.O. Box 2855 Humble, Texas 77347.